think the comment that Nigel Farage made about the Romanians is racist. Well, I was anticipating um, this question, Colette, and I actually <laughs> realised that my answer to this is that what his comments are is xenophobic. And I looked that up in the dictionary, and what it is is, is an intense or irrational dislike or fear of people from other countries. That's what Nigel Farage is. What, what's the he difference, is xenophobic. Though? What's the difference well, between racism and xenophobia? Because it's a generalised yeah. dislike or fear of people from other countries. And the truth is, it does legitimise racist views and it gives racists a kind of spring in their step to hear all this divide and rule, all against outsiders, everything would be fine if we didn't have them. It's the easiest thing to divide everybody from each other. He's even dividing immigrants who are here now from the people who are coming well, he, here. It's he, all divide and rule. He's uh, dividing Ed Miliband and David Lammy because David Lammy thinks it is racist. And Ed Miliband has said he completely disapproves of what uh, Nigel Farage said when he was talking on LBC about not wanting to have uh, Romanians living next door. And, you know, that is his stock in trade. And the trouble is, it does have an impact because it makes people feel divided. And you can look in other countries to where this is taken to an extreme. It really ends up in quite a nasty situation. I don't want anybody being name called in the street because of where they've come from. I don't want anybody to fear that they can't go out at night because they might be, you know, punched because of, you know, the colour of their skin. And people who are leading a party I mean, like Nigel Farage's, his words have implications. You, you sound as if you are equating him with the Front National in, in France. Well, I think it's the result of what he does and the climate that he creates actually leads to division and fear and I just think it's very negative politics and uh, I think it's the politics of hatred and division and I, I really deplore it. I think a lot of people who might be thinking about voting UKIP because UKIP is, you know, portraying itself as outside the traditional parties and the underdog, you know, I would say I hope they will realise that there is no future in local communities with everybody turned against each other you know, we've got to work together and support okay. each other not all be blaming and finger pointing it's like Nigel Farage, oh everything would be fine if we didn't have Romanians here or if we, if we didn't have immigrants here, I mean it's and also, you know, I mean this is ridiculous, he's, he's married to somebody from a different country and she's no doubt very welcome here